610 is the time right now. New this morning, today could be one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. NASA says it, it could launch the largest spacecraft it's ever built for a planetary mission as early as this afternoon. Annie has been following this closely and joins us now. And Annie is there set to explore a potentially habitable, habitable place yeah. for life beyond Earth. Yeah, it's all so very fascinating. In just a few hours, a spacecraft is set to blast off from Kennedy Space Center, of course, in Florida, in search of the potential for life beyond Earth, possibly a place for humans, us, to call home. It's called the Europa Clipper, named after its destination, an icy moon of Jupiter. Scientists think that Europa is one of the best bets in the solar system for life beyond Earth. Under its surface, they believe it has an ocean with tides from Jupiter's gravity that produces heat and NASA says the clipper carries nine instruments for testing those conditions along with a gravity experiment. But don't expect that data anytime soon. The journey between Earth and Europa spans about 1.8 million or billion miles, billion miles, which will take about 10 years because Jupiter is so far away. So Allison Wisdom, this will, of course, give us better insight into the conditions necessary for life. And I think that's super fascinating. And something else that I found while looking into this mission is that the spacecraft will actually carry a unique design etched with 2.6 million names submitted by the public, hmm. poetry and artwork symbolizing humanity. So I like that little touch to the yeah. to the clipper. The arts uh, humanities yeah. will live on yeah. no matter where we are. That's right. right. That's great. So Earth then we got Mars and maybe <laughs> Europa. We're looking mm -hmm. for places. We're yeah. going to have lots of room to spread out. <laughs> Eventually. <laughs> In the universe. I'll stay right, right here. Home. I'm okay. good. Right. <laughs> Me too. All right. I'll text you later, Annie. Okay. okay. <laughs>